So, good day everyone. So, for today, I will be going to share on how to improve my communication skills. So, I am Genevieve Lopez from Bachelor of Physical Education, major in school sport, second year student from the Lyceum Northwestern University. So, first, listen, listen, or listen. People want to know that they are being heard. Will they listen to what the other person is saying instead of formulating your response? Ask for clarification to avoid misunderstanding. Second, who you are to talking to matters. It is okay to use acronyms and informal language when you are communicating with the body, but if you are emailing or texting your boss, Hey, TTYL or any informal language has no place in your message. Third, body language matters. This is important to face-to-face -face meetings and video conferencing. Make sure that you appear accessible so have open body language. This means that you should not cross your arms and keep eye contact so that the other person knows that you are paying attention. Fourth, check your messages before you hit send. Spell and grammar checkers are life savers, but they are not foolproof. Double check what you have written to make sure that your words are communicating the intended me message. Fifth, be brief yet specific. For written and verbal communication, practice being brief yet specific enough that you provide enough information for the other person to understand what you are trying to say. And if you are responding to an email, make sure that you read the entire email before crafting your response. With enough practice, you will learn not to rumble or give way too much information. See, who you are. Six, write, I think write things down. Take notes while you are talking to another person or when you are in a meeting, and do not relay on your memory. Send a follow-up email to make sure that you understand what was being said during the conversation. 7. Sometimes, it's better to pick up the phone. If you find that you have a lot to say, instead of of sending an email, call the person instead. Email is great, but sometimes it is easier to communicate what you have to say verbally. 8. Think before you speak. Always pause before you speak, not saying the first thing that comes to mind. Take a moment and pay close attention to what you say and how you say it. This one habit will allow you to avoid embarrassments. 9. Treat everyone equally. Do not talk down to anyone. Treating everyone with respect. Treat others as your equal. For the last, maintain a positive attitude and smile. Even when you are speaking on the phone, smile because your positive attitude will shine through and the other person will know it.